Okay, this is a painting video for Wild Writer. I'm gonna. Okay, first I'm gonna paint the fur in moon, moon fang or something like that. Brown. Maybe in a second. Okay, I'm gonna start. I've painted. That focus. I've painted the wild rider is fur brown. I'm gonna so I'm gonna start painting the orc on top. This is also the same way I'm I would paint orcs in um a painting video just I don't I will I might make one one day if I get more orcs like maybe I'll do one if I get Moran and Orcs. But today I'm just going to be painting this Orc and that's roughly how I paint Orcs. I've painted the bow and the boots brown. You might think that clashes with, that doesn't work with the fur, but the fur will be dry brushed later. Now I'm going to move on to the fur on the back of him and like little bits of fur like on the model like here and here. Okay, I'll be back in a second. I'm going to use green grey on the back of the fur here and on the fur around here-ish. Okay, paint is the fur and stuff in there. You can see it a little bit more easily now. Right about there ish. And the fur on the back. Okay, now I'm going to paint the orc's uh, skin right here with London grey. It gives you that grey blue colour that some of the orcs had in the movie. Okay, painted the skin on the orc. The skin does darken a little bit, but otherwise it's pretty good. Next step is I'm gonna wait for the fur to dry and gonna dry brush the fur with Vallejo canvas. On the Panzer Aces thing. I'm going to paint the head, that colour, the top fur, and I'm going to dry brush all the other fur. But first it needs to dry. Okay, I've painted the Wog's head with that colour. And dry brushed the fur. The oh, okay. The next step I'm gonna do is some a metal color, a red belcher. I'm gonna use it on little bits of armor on him, and I thought, and I thought I'd paint the teeth with it because I don't know having what looks like metal teeth would be quite cool and a little bit frightening if you're on the opposite end of them. Okay, you might be able to see the metal here. Give me a second. Yeah, and I painted the teeth that as well. It's more obvious on a one with an open mouth. Your next step it from is going to be put eh, dot the eyes with a red. So I'll be down. I'm gonna be using Bethesda red for the eyes. Okay. 
there we go. I'm gonna clean up in a minute. I'm gonna clean up actually. Clean around the eyes. So it looks good but and that but then afterwards I'm gonna give it a wash in Army Painter Strong Tone Ink. Now it's time to give it a wash of Strong Tone Ink all over the model basically. There are some key spots like the face of the orc and stuff. Stuff like that. that if you just want to do that, you can, but I'm gonna go over most of the with it. Okay, this is after the wash, it's still drying. I did do another one, wash another one, but this is exactly the same to this guy, so. Well, actually, he was. He was the original painting tutorial guy, but. Uh, had an incident and then something bad went happened and then ruined the video so now so it is pretty done much done only basing is left I'm not gonna really show the basing in this video I might base do a recording record myself basing um, in the future maybe but for now, that's it for today's video. Hope you enjoyed, and uh, bye.